so hey, this is a bit awkward. We have no new features to show. I'm here with some coffee and cheesecake for the night. Um, not so sure what to tell you. Kidding! Of course we do! I did not joke about the cheesecake though. It's good. Welcome everybody to this release video for Thing Launcher. This release is a celebration to your creative side. Now, we have realized that maybe not everybody like our pinkish, reddish kind of thing color. Or, as one user said, it's really ugly and it gives me eye cancer. Don't hold back! Here at Thing, we do our very best to please anonymous people on the internet. And we figured, why not let our amazing users customize and let loose their creative side and make Thing exactly the way they want it to be. You want dark mode? Done. You want a funky Miami Vice neon theme? Sure. Or do you like K-pop, pink and bright yellow? We've got you covered. And what do I do? I celebrate this colorful location by wearing a gray t-shirt. Uh, can we fix this in post? Make it pink. Anyway, let's take a look. <laughs> Set up Katy Perry fan site. Here we are again at my home screen. Are you ready for this? Because I know I'm not. Let's start by creating a dark theme, since so many of you have asked for it. First, head into settings and then look and feel. At the very top, you should now see a new entry called Colors. Tap it. And here you see all the things that you can change color on. To In At You can change colors on your home screen, the app drawer, folders, settings and badges. Let's start with the app drawer. First, tap background. You'll now see the color picker. Let's slide the brightness slider all the way down there. Good, dark, nice dark gray. Sorry. Now tap navigation background. That's the main navigation drawer inside the app drawer. And yes, that's the technical term. Nice app navigation drawer thingy magic. Let's make it pretty much the same dark gray as the background, like that. Good. Now the icons in the navigation, let's do a light gray. That will look good. Scroll down, tap app name. I think you can guess what it does. Let's make it bright white so we can see the app names clearly. Then go titles. They should be a bit brighter so you have some nice contrast. Good. And the same goes for descriptions. My precious. Then down to highlight, which is our signature reddish pinkish color that you all love so much. Let's try a cool orange to go with our dark gray. A little bit darker, maybe a bit light like that. That's good, that's good. Stop, stop, stop. The same goes for the buttons in our footer. Sit. Now we change the separator between the sections to... Awesome, let's see how that looks. Go back home and then we open the app drawer. The same goes for settings. As you can see, the color settings are applied in real time. That should make you go, whoa. Unless, you know, of course, you're dead inside. In the meantime, we also updated the badges to complete the look. What? That's it? We're not doing... I thought we had the thing with the... whatever, no? Apparently, this is it for this release. Uh, we'd love for you to email screenshots of your funky themes. Please, send them all to hello at thing.se. We can't wait to see how creative you get with the colors. Remember, this is just a start. Later, we'll allow you to save these themes, so you can quickly switch between them whenever you feel like it. Sad to say, that's all the time we had. We had to cut it short due to unpaid bills, so they'll cut our power anytime soon. No matter, we'll see you next time. Um, are we out? Okay. All right, screw this. I'm having the cheesecake. Can we start a fire in the there in the corner there? Yeah, exactly. I don't know. Get some bills. I don't. Care. It's fine.